friends good morning today i'm going to discuss shortcut number 13 on limits friends today i'm going to reveal the shortcut on bracket x and fractional part of x bracket x and fractional part of x bracket x having three names friends one is greatest integer function second one is integral part of x and the third one is step function of x friends so by using bracket x and fractional part of x also we are going to do the sums very very easily and fraction of seconds enough and moreover first of all i'm going to discuss by problems afterwards i want to reveal the shortcut so look at carefully how we are going to solve the sum within fraction of seconds limit n tends to infinity bracket x plus bracket 2x plus so on plus bracket nx whole by n square it is nothing but very simple friends x by 2 is the answer within one second enough to evaluate coming to second question limit n tends to infinity bracket 1 square x plus bracket 2 square x plus so on plus bracket n square x by n cube that is what uh, just very simple x by 3 is equal to your answer friends so what is the secret behind it look at carefully friends the following formula limit n tends to infinity 1 power kx bracket 1 power kx plus bracket 2 power kx plus so on plus bracket n power kx whole by n power k plus 1 can be written as the formula is whatever brackets are there please write down the numerator as x and whatever denominator look at carefully the denominator it is numerator is k k k is going on denominator just one is extra k plus 1 n power k plus 1 is there friends that's what the denominator just you write down this k plus 1 friends that's all your shortcut friends it's a very very easiest shortcut and you can able to crack within one second now look at friends very simple limit n tends to infinity bracket x plus bracket 2x plus so on plus bracket n x by n square if you see nothing is there means the here 1 power 1 is there then this is what 2 power 1 1 power 1 and 2 power 1 3 power 1 so on n power 1 by n square first of all check it whether it is in formation or not yes absolutely if it is power 1s are going on here 1 plus 1 2 is going on that's what definitely you can able to apply the shortcut that's what numerator you are going to get x and denominator just you write down this power that's all the answer short friends next coming to next limit n tends to t bracket 1 square x plus bracket 2 square x plus so on plus bracket n square x by n cube so now powers are in bracket x the powers are uh, 2s and the denominator 2 plus 1 is there so absolutely it is nothing but the formation that's what we can able to write x by 3 friends so that's all the sheet shortcut and secret and now i'm going to discuss about fractional part of x so what is a fractional part of x then how we are going to evaluate the sums in fractional part of x look at carefully friends yes friends before i'm going to reveal fractional part of x related problem i want to discuss about fractional part of x look at carefully friends so first of all fractional part of x we are going to denote with uh, this kind of brackets and integral part of x we are going to denote with uh, this kind of brackets friends so now if you add integral part of x and fractional part of x you are going to give the value as x friends so very simple friends integral part of x means uh, always it gives an integer always it gives an integer so fractional part of x means it, in that name only it is there friends uh, fractional part of x it gives always a fraction quantity friends so that's what for example a number x is equals to 5.2 is there means uh, so bracket x is nothing but 5 and integral part of x is nothing but 0.5 and moreover integral part of x the fractional part of x always lies between 0 and 1 friends fractional part of x is always lies between 0 and 1 friends that's what 0.2 it takes and 5 it takes friends so this is a one example i discussed with friends so 5 plus 0.2 gives 5.2 friends so now you can able to write if you want fractional part of x related question friends fractional part of x you want means just you send integral part of x that side or else we can call greatest integer function or step function of x you send this side friends then bracket x can be written as fractional part of x can be written as x minus bracket x friends x minus greatest integer function friends now i want to substitute this quantity in fractional part of area now limit n tends to infinity so fractional part of x can be written as x minus bracket x just now i discussed so x minus bracket x plus bracket 2x fractional part of 2x can be written as 2x minus bracket 2x plus so on plus fractional part of nx can be written as nx minus integral part of nx or greatest integer of nx whole by n square friends this is equals to friends limit n tends to infinity now i want to separate x plus 2x plus 3x plus so on plus nx 
and uh, I want to take x as common 1 plus 2 plus 3 plus so on plus n and remaining uh, uh, in remaining bracket x values I want to take minus as common you are going to get uh, bracket x plus uh, bracket 2x plus uh, so on plus uh, bracket nx friends whole by n square now I want to split this n square for this and as well as this here x is a constant because uh, here function is going on n to infinity whenever function running on n x we are going to treat as constant that's what i'm going to take x as outside limit n tends to infinity this is what 1 plus 2 plus 3 plus 1 plus n can be written as sigma n sigma n is nothing but what sir n into n plus 1 by 2 that's what i'm going to substitute here n into n plus 1 by 2 into n square is there now as well as i want to split the limit also so that's what uh, minus limit n tends to infinity friends uh, i'm going to write bracket x plus bracket 2x uh, plus so on plus uh, bracket nx uh, whole by n square friends now if you see according to our shortcut uh, i i did one shortcut on uh, infinite model according to infinite model if you see if you take n as common this is n square then whenever numerator power and denominator powers are same then the coefficient is nothing but your shortcut if you don't know anyone so just i want to keep it in description box so look at once the infinite model shortcut so now according to the previous shortcut this quarter total quantity can be written as 1 by 2 friends minus uh, just now I discussed friends limit n times infinity bracket x plus bracket 2x plus 1 plus bracket n x by n square is equals to x by 2 that's what this quantity becomes x by 2 friends friends if you observe x into 1 by 2 means x by 2 minus x by 2 the quantity will become 0 that's all friends it's a very very important area friends now this quantity will become what friends 0 now this is the most most important area friends so in the competitive examination they are given this kind of questions friends that's what I discussed today shortcut on these friends so that's all for today friends it's a very very important area please look at carefully friends okay that's all for today thank you thank you very much friends